Hey folks, Colin here with Anglers All, and today I'm gonna to show you how to tie a perfection loop for attaching your own built leaders to that welded loop in modern fly lines. Really what we use this most for is tying your own leaders. So if you're doing a lot of streamer fishing or you like to build your own leaders without having to tie a nail knot, uh, this is a great way to build a loop at the top of your leader setup so that you can just utilize the loop-to-loop -loop connection on any modern fly line. So I'm gonna start with that leader material in my left hand and create a overhand knot with the running line behind. Go ahead and pinch that in my forefinger and thumb in my left hand. And then I'm gonna take the running line, this piece right here, and wrap it around. Sometimes you can use your thumb to hold that in place if it's a more rigid material. Uh, this fly line isn't as great for that. So again, you're gonna make that loop behind and then wrap your material forwards and then control that with your left and uh, thumb and forefinger again. Then we're gonna take that running line, split it between the two loops, go ahead and control, and then we'll pull that front loop, this guy right here, through the back loop and start to seat that knot down. Now you wanna make sure that when you're seating this that your tag end, this one up here in my uh, middle and pointer finger, is perpendicular to the knot. If that's not sitting in that orientation, the knot's actually not set correctly and it can turn into a bit of a slip knot. Uh, but here you can see it's pointed 90 degrees from the knot itself and that knot is strong. You can pull on that and that loop is not going to slip. At this point, we'll just come in with some clippers, take our tag off, and now you've got a loop at the top of your leaders that you can use again to uh, connect with a loop-to-loop -loop connection to your fly line and you're good to go.